Okay, what I'm going to be going through in this uh, video segment is a simple calculator that I made. Uh, the calculator has one function, which is addition. And to make the calculator, I use uh, exclusive OR gates, OR gates, AND gates, and a few other components which we'll talk about. Uh, so let's take a look at this calculator right now. Okay, for this simple calculator, I'm using uh, switches to input my numbers into the calculator. So at the bottom of the screen here, it's a little bit difficult to see, but at the bottom of the screen I have uh, eight switches. Uh, four of them are being used to put in uh, one uh, number and four others are being used to put in the second number that we're going to add for this calculator. Okay, so for this calculator, as I indicated, I'm going to be adding two numbers together. On this calculator, the first number that I'm inputting will be displayed on this seven segment display over here. Uh, the second number that I'm going to be putting in will be displayed on this number, this seven segment display over here. And the total of the two numbers will be displayed on these two seven segment displays up here. In the middle here, I have my logic chips which are used to do the addition of the numbers and to help to display the values that you'll see on those four seven segment displays. Okay, let's go ahead and turn the lights down a little bit lower so that we can see the uh, results of our numbers being added. Okay, and as you can see once again I have my uh, two numbers that I'm inputting. This is one number down here, and this is a second number and those two numbers then would be summed together to give me a total number up here at the top okay so first I'm gonna start off with something really simple so let's add one and one together so as you can see this number became one and this is still zero one plus zero give me the number one and if I go ahead and change the second number here now to one there we go we have the total of two for that so that's one plus one gives us two if I change the second number here to 3, that gives me 3 plus 1, the total of 4. Uh, let's try something a little bit different here. Um, let's add the number 5 to the number uh, 8, and so that gives me a total of 13. 8 plus 3, or 8 plus 5, pardon me, and gives us a total of 13 up at the top. So for this calculator, like I mentioned, uh, it goes up to, I think it's a number 15. Uh, after number 15, it's going to display, I have an LED over here on the right side, which displays that there is an, a carry, and so the data that's up here at the top wouldn't quite make sense to us. So let's go ahead and demonstrate that. Uh, let's bring this back down to all zeros. And so I'm going to add number 8 and the number 8 together. And you'll notice that the LED over here comes on and the values that are up here doesn't make sense. Okay, And that's to indicate that there's a carry and to the person that's using the calculator that they shouldn't um, uh, take uh, the value that, are sh that is shown up here as the actual truth. Okay, Alright, so there's a very simple uh, demonstration of a calculator that I put together. Uh, in upcoming segments, I'm going to simplify this circuit here so that there's uh, uh, less chips on here. And I'm going to add the subtraction function to this calculator so that we can not only do addition, but we can also do subtraction.